Welcome to Chemistry Tutorial 360. Today we are going to balance this reaction, right? Magnesium nitrate, then we are getting after heating magnesium oxide, nitrogen dioxide, and oxygen. Actually, this is one of the toughest reactions in chemistry, and I think most of the students will fail to balance this reaction but i have a way that will help you to balance this reaction so at first to balance this re reaction we have to draw a table like this this is reactant side so in the reactant side we have one magnesium so let me write one here look at here then here we have uh, two nitrogen these two apply for everyone so two nitrogen and here we have uh, these two apply for everyone that is we have to multiply these three by two that is we have here six oxygen on the right hand side we have one magnesium and then here we have one oxygen and then look at here here we have two oxygen and then here we have one oxygen so basically we are getting here one two two sorry here i have to put here two two right so basically we are getting five oxygen here okay now here we have just one nitrogen okay to balance this reaction we have to balance the number of magnesium nitrogen oxygen from both sides right okay look at here to balance the magnesium we have to look at the number of magnesium so one one so magnesium is already balanced so nitrogen two two nitrogen two one so nitrogen is not balanced so to balance the nitrogen what can I do? I can multiply here by 2. That gives me 2. Look at here. These 2 must come before this nitrogen. That is, this nitrogen has come from here. So I have to put here 2. Right? So if I put here 2, the number of nitrogen will be 2. The number of oxygen will be changed. So we are getting here 4 oxygen. So I have to write here 4 oxygen. Okay? Now, 4 plus 2 plus 1, that is, we have here 7 uh, oxygen, right? Okay. Now, look at the number of hydrogen. Nitrogen is balanced to 2. Oxygen 6 and 7. Oxygen is not balanced. Actually, this 7 is odd number, but this 6 is a even number. And what even creates actually problem right so in this case you have to uh, think that you have nothing to do but look at here if if you take to make it even you have you can change here if you take two magnesium here so that is if you take two magnesium then these two must come before this magnesium that is here so if you put here two the number of magnesium will be two and the number of oxygen will be changed here so you have to take here two oxygen so two plus four six plus two eight oxygen right basically you are getting eight oxygen and this is even number right so this will help us to balance this equation look at here in the right hand side we have two magnesium but in the left hand side we have one magnesium so to balance the number of magnesium i can multiply here two and that gives me two these two must come before this magnesium that is here so look at here if i put here two the number of magnesium will be two and the number of nitrogen will be here two times 2 that is 4 so we are getting 4 nitrogen and we are getting here 
6 times 2 that is 12 12 oxygen right so and this is even even number right even number however even you have to if you get what an even then you have to make it even so to now we have to try to balance the number of oxygen so here we have 12 but here we have 8 but look at here our the number of magnesium is balanced the number of nitrogen is not balanced so here we have 2 but here we have 4 to balance the number of nitrogen i can multiply here by 2 that gives me 4 these two must come before this nitrogen that is here so if you put here 2 then these two these two will multiply each other so we are getting here 4 right so 4 means we have 4 nitrogen and we have here 8 oxygen so we have to change here 8 right so 8 so now add this 8 plus 2 10 plus 2 12 so 12 now our oxygen is balanced 12 12 oxygen is balanced the nitrogen 4 4 is balanced and magnesium 2 2 is balanced so you can say that this is the balance equation at last you have to change this sign right with equal sign so this is the balanced equation and you see that this is one of the toughest reactions in chemistry to balance so thank you for being this video be well